Good evening, everybody. Another paint with Troy. We had a. Uh, what was our thing called again? Why am I forgetting it? Our event. Uh, blind date with a painting. A blind date with a painting went awesome. All ten spots were picked within the first twenty-four hours, which was freaking awesome. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I think the 25th, we're still, tr we're still trying to figure out exactly how we're going to do it. But I think that night will be a fun night. Everybody will get an idea of what they're... Well, you won't see what you're getting, but you, uh, you're going to see your box packaged up. So I got a lot of work to do from now until the 25th. Of February. Of February, sorry. Of February. I'm hoping my boxes come in time because uh, I was running low. So we had to pre-order some. They're supposed to be here by the end of the month, but that could be who knows when. But other than that, I really appreciate you having showing interest in the paintings and willing to take a chance. Appreciate it. Here's a couple of people there that already have paintings. Um, if they want to come make comments, that would be awesome. Let us know, let everybody know what you think of your painting that you have. Um, that would be nice. Uh, like and share. And if you could, take a picture of your painting that you bought, that you got of it. Post it on our page and tag us. I'd appreciate it. Like, share, and comment. The, the more like, share, and... Comments, the better. I really appreciate it. If you like the painting, Diane make a quick comment. Huh? Diane says good evening. Hey, Diane. You got a painting coming your way, huh? Ariel was the one to let her know. <laughs> yeah, she, she tagged Ariel to help her. Gotcha. Perfect. Uh, I tried to tag her, but I wasn't able to because we weren't friends at the time. But we're friends now, so I can tag her and everything. <laughs> nice. Okay, well, what we need to do is, well, when it gets closer to the 25th, Chrissy will, will make a post saying what, what our goals are and how we're going to do it. We're hopefully going to do it on a Saturday night. And... I'm going to do all the pre-boxes, get them ready, but you'll actually see me put the painting in the box, but you won't know what the painting is. That's the best part. Me and the, me and the wife were out there trying to go through the paintings and figure out which ones, and that's not going the best. <laughs> but me and the wife, we'll figure them out. We'll get the paintings in there. And if you guys can, uh, once you get your painting... Do your unveiling of your box. Tag us in the post, which would be awesome. So then we'd have a bunch of posts of people getting their painting. And I think it's just going to be fun. Um, Diane says that Ariel washes out for her grandma. And yeah. that's why she knows. That's awesome. That's the way it's supposed to, that's the way it's supposed to be. Oh my gosh, I have to shut this fan off because it's super cold. Man, I woke up this morning and it was 46 degrees. I live in Florida. It's not oh I'm living Florida. It's not supposed to be 46 degrees. I should be able to leave the house with a short sleeve shirt on. All right, I think I got my brush somewhat clean. That looks pretty good. Yeah, I've been I've been painting up a storm lately. I've got I've not even sure treat Chris. How many paintings have I done in the last couple weeks? Because it was... 
No, you know what? I'm going to go find out because I got them. I got them all in the drying room right now. Freaking Tan! Ten paintings I've gotten inspired. Now with you guys wanting to take a chance on getting a blind painting, gives me more inspiration. Uh, it's kind of nice that all the people that have started watching and following, they've seen me from the first starting out about, what, seven, eight months ago? To now where the paintings are looking different. A little more technique in the paintings now. Michelle is on it. Is that Michelle on here? Looks like Grandma Shar's picture in the corner. I think that's Michelle. Awesome, awesome. Glad to see you. So this could be fun sending them paintings up. The UPS guy is going to look at me and go, what the heck is this? I'll probably run out of fragile stickers. No, I, that rule had, what, 500 on it? Yeah. Yeah, but I put them on. I put them on every side. I know and you're supposed to. Just make sure that you wrap it entirely in bubble wrap, just because we know that when boxes get delivered, they do like to be put into snow, and we would really rather not them get. Well, what I'm thinking about doing, I might be putting them in garbage bags. Uh, yeah, that would work too. I'm thinking about putting uh, all the ones that are going up north are going to get put into garbage bags. And the only one I won't have to is Lily's. Yeah, because hers is going to Texas. Because she's going to Texas where it's warm. Well, I guess Texas gets kind of cool too, though. All right, who else popped on here? Oh, that's Diane. Yeah, I get... I get Diane, she makes a lot of comments on the post and some of the stuff that I'm doing. That's great. If we can keep sharing, keep sharing them and keep posting them and comment, commenting on them, that would be much appreciated. The more engagement that we get, the more likely we, likely we are to be able to continue doing it and then also be able to get closer get. to our long-term goal which is to be able to do online classes um, or like more like paint-alongs for veterans who are looking for alternatives as far as um, mental health being able to mental health being able to have a voice without necessarily having to use their voice yep they can put it they can put their voice on a canvas I mainly started this out because I wanted to help out veterans, and I've gotten away from putting flags in, but I'm going to have to start doing that again here pretty soon. Um, yeah. I got one painting that I want to do that I um, paint with Josh. He's got a painting of a wave scene where the background is Amer uh, an American flag. It is so cool. I'm planning on attempting it on... Tuesday, so we'll see if that turns into a hodgepodge mess or something really nice. But usually I get things to work, even if it starts out kind of rough, I get them to work, but that's what I love about painting. I never know exactly what I'm doing when I get started, which is the most fun. And 
Tell him thank you for his service. I appreciate it. My heart goes out to every veteran out there. It's, it also needs to and be present. Said. Yeah. And I mean, a lot, a, a lot of the original greats are are men, you know. So it's, it's definitely something to uh, to throw out there, and and you know, not look at the not look at the few bad apples out there that were also painters, but yeah. <laughs> um, no, we 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 celebrate that. painting. We celebrate it. This is what keeps us going, as it keeps me going. It makes me feel really good about myself, which I really don't have to because I'm a pretty positive person anyway. But okay, well, there's a little bit. There's a difference. There's a difference between being mad at a program versus mad at life in general. Okay, this is true. We had you know. See, we're, see, everybody that's on here, they literally get to see us learning and hopefully getting better. I'm trying to save up. I'm hoping my paintings will end up letting me get a laptop so I can place a laptop in front of me where I can actually read some of the comments too. We're working on getting more cameras. Um, eventually, I want to try to get Chrissy down here for a week where we can really try to fine-tune everything that's going on. And get my pile of paintings in order, which I have no idea how we're going to do that. I've got 138 paintings right now. No, soon, minus as, all as 15. Actually, yeah, as soon as I'm actually physically there, it's going to be easier for me to actually develop a system on how I want to make sure that the inventory is maintained. And Yeah, it's going to be... That's going to be an expensive weekend, too. <laughs> no, no, not necessarily. Hey, see my shirt? See my shirt? Painting Grandpa, number one. All right, we got to get some more people on here so I can start painting. Let's get some more people. Come on. Yeah, he's probably he's probably pretty busy doing his rings and stuff. So he's a yeah, he's a busy man. That, that I'll tell you, go check out Freedom Rings. They're beautiful rings. I have the dream one that I want. It's got a bright yellow fishing line wrapped around the ring, and it's got like three fish hooks inside the ring. It is gorgeous. I don't wear rings, but this if I got that ring. But for like Father's Day or something like that. <laughs> hint, hint. I would wear it as a wedding ring because it, this thing is gorgeous. Go check it out. Go check it out. You, you're going to like it. Hey, with Josh, if you want to learn some techniques, he's really good. I'm learning. I'm still learning. And I enjoy the fact that every time I do something, I realize, oh, man, I was messing up a while ago. Now it's starting to come together. I'm not. No, there's no messing up of it, though. No, nope, they're, they're all happy mistakes, but every time you have a happy mistake, you learn something. I do need you to adjust the camera, though. What's wrong with it? We're cut off a little bit on the right side. They're going to back it up a yeah, little bit? Sorry. That might be a little bit better. Huh? Finn hasn't gone down for a nap at all today, and he was up at like six. Oh, that's not good. Uh, well, he's still going like a champ, so we'll see how long it is before he's passed out. All right, let's. You know what? Let's start. Let's start painting since uh, we can't let the people down that have been here from the get go. 
from the start. So let's get started. What's going on there? The Finn? No, it was Esme. Oh, Esme. But both of, yeah, both of them are being... Pills? Rambunctious little turds. So. Yeah. All right. We're, we're going gonna, we're gonna to start trying to get some... We're going to try to get some pop of color in here. <laughs> I know, right? You're behind the scenes. I got enough of it now. Oh, yeah. some color there, huh? put some pressure on here. That's kind of kind of odd. I never really had to do that. It's kind of kind of like the way that's turning out a little bit. Try to get it to go a different direction. There we go. If you don't stop putting that in your mouth, I will take it off. Stop. Just be like a, a whole just sky scene. 
Nope, she's going to have some land in it. Well, yeah, I know, but I'm just saying. Well, that's kind of a cool looking, uh, That kind of looks cool. A little bit of contrast there.
I still haven't figured out how to, I'm going to have to figure out how a way to start getting more paint because that's getting expensive. I spent like 90 bucks last time I went. Then tomorrow, or Tuesday, I'm going to get enough uh, uh, 24 by 36 um, picture frame. And one of the big paintings that I've done, I'm going to cut it out. I'm going to take it off the board. And I'm going to put it in a frame, picture frame. Oh my gosh. And as everybody that knows me, they know what I'm going to be putting in here. What am I going to be putting in here, Chris? Uh, water. <laughs> There's probably going to be water. But what else? Uh, I feel like you're going to end up finding a way to put an American flag in there somewhere. Ah, uh, nope, not in this one. No? No, I don't think so. I, 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 know. I think... You know what I spent my birthday money from you on? Huh. That, nothing wrong with that. You have purchased me so many ebooks this year between Christmas and my birthday, it is not even funny. That's good. I want to say, like, at least 20 books were purchased by you. One of them was even a physical copy.
Am I boring you, Chrissy? No, I happen to run a circus in my home. Gotcha. Which is why I have the circus theme song set in my head. Gotcha. Uh, Not in this one. I just started doing uh, animals. I got one that I'm going to do this weekend that's going to be uh, a, 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 big, a bigger deer instead of just a little guy hiding. He's going to be in the middle of it and he's going to be close to us. So he'll be a lot bigger. This might end up being a winter scene still. Um, <coughs> Diane says she's still waiting for the loons. The what? Oh, yeah. Diane, yeah, she says she's still waiting for the loons. Yeah, that one might be a little bit. I gotta try to figure out how to do it size wise. Dad? What? I'm gonna hang up on you for a second. Alright. <laughs> yeah. What happened? I have no idea. Did nobody else answer but me? No, just you. Getting what? Diane says she's just giving you go. Amy is busy, apparently. Travis didn't answer. Lily can't be reached. That's all right.
What the heck was that? Apparently, Finn is using Ben as a double gem. Ah. I don't know why I like pine trees so much. I don't know. I think it's because they're so much fun to do. Probably is. Something else you wanted me to mention. I can't remember what it was. side leaning into the other so it kind of gives it a like you're laying on the ground looking up at it and it kind of changes your perspective
I'm not even sure how he would. Okay, you're supposed to be liking what's on here, you know. I like that too, but look. Yep. color in here. I kind of like in the way this is looking. Shit. Ugh. My hand cramped up. Uh oh. Whew. Gotta take a breather. Have you gotten a chance to use all of the knives that I sent over? I've dabbled with them. I used one of them for, for rocks. Yeah. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna put some rocks in here. The thing is, I don't know. You don't know what? You can't just stop talking in the middle of a sentence, Dad. I don't know if I got enough going on in this painting.
like Teresa said, I got to start s simplifying a little bit because it it uh, it adds to it. Right. Because I'm I, what what do you call it? I'm a loud painter. Be because. Well, I like, I, I, what I mean by that is I'm a, I love color. Yeah, but I also feel like your color is not like, I feel like your color is not loud, it's relatively accurate. I feel like loud it should be, you know, those people that do neon paints and, you know what I mean? Yep. I wonder if I should put some green in this or if I should make it snow. Am I, is the, is the camera level? No, it's just the way it's portrayed on here. It's just Where is that? I'm looking for my little spatula that I was using. There it is.
Yeah. That's really long. It's really long. And I'm very tempted to chop it off. But at the same time, if I do that, that means I actually have to do something with it every day. Exactly. See here is I'm using your Kind of did his backwards. I think I had to put the snow in here. You're homesick. It could be.
It could be. Kind of like in the way this is turning out. I kind of like my little rock bed here. I don't know. What do you think? I like it. I think it's looking pretty good. But you don't like to listen to me. This kind of didn't really, not ex, not what I was expecting to. I feel like we needed to go into it with a little bit more. Huh? maybe too many trees in here. Did you see Jairus as the answer? No. Or the title? Uh-uh. Of oh, the lightning one? Uh-uh. The one that I was calling my daughter made me do it? What was it? Oh, 
I got some good reflection there. Good reflection there. few more stones over here. Happy accidents. I like happy accidents. You know, every now and then I gotta have ones that don't turn out, don't do what I want them to. to brighten it up a little bit? I think I should. Honestly, Dad, I feel like you should leave it darker. Darker? I feel like there should be some shadowing in the snow. I don't know. I, I, have, a, I have a pretty dark mentality, though, so... I wonder if I should put a birch tree in. I mean, it looks pretty good. I 
I got some of the green in there from up there. I I don't know. The couch is big enough for all three of you. Well, it's definitely got northern lights behind the pine trees, which looks cool. You know what? I'm going to put some stars in and call it a day. But the problem is, is I gotta put the stars in last so they don't run. Yeah. So what I'm gonna do is end the live. Thank you for coming on. Thanks for sticking around, Michelle. Happy days. Uh that didn't look too bad. No, I think it looks really good. It looks pretty cool. Alrighty, I love you all, and uh, you guys have a good one, and we'll make a few more live videos, and we'll get some of the start to finishes out there. Love you all, have a good one.